politics is not just about religion, ethnicity, or even who you know that's talking about um, having a godfather. How do you think we can overcome this? Thank you very much. Anybody who is thinking the way you are thinking you should vote for one, I should vote for uh, Obidat Kate. He's the only man who can unite the country. Anything outside it, you are dividing the country the more. Right in there, Jeff Tokwe, as far as I'm concerned, I'm a passing message. At 94, how many of my age people are alive? But because one, you people, you can't have a united country where you discriminate against a section of the country. If you want us to separate, let us separate in peace. You can't say we are together and you discriminate against that. Or people get there and discriminate. We know all the force of what we see. All the claims that we are alleging against Obi as a Nipo and all that. Many of them were allegations before Obi himself was born. I am in a position to know that. But that is not the issue now. All those are things of the past. The man who can hold the country today forward in unity. Let's be there. That is running man there, fantastic fellow, intelligent, hardworking, progressive. It's not a question whether it's Philadelphia or not. You look at their criteria, their category. There are not people who made money by, by, by government contracts. We go there when we get to the election. Obi is the man to unite the country. Obi is the man to say, yeah, whether you are Igbo or Hausa, it doesn't matter. What is matter is that the stress of Nigeria. And if anybody listens to me, unfortunately, how many of you are remaining? The type of Nigeria that we fought for is the only Obi that can carry it out and, and, and it's running mate. They can see into the future. All the past with this and all that, forget it. We want to move forward. Obi's administration is not only changing the personnel, we want to change the system. We are them talking about being a government without being a millionaire. Tim Noka, imagine what this country is. As any of those principal parties. If you are not a billionaire, how can you be a president? If you are not a billionaire, how can you be a governor? When you say you don't want to be a governor, a graduate, well educated, come and pay 100 million. Even to be a councillor, those are the systems that we want to change. Those are the systems we are supporting him to change. So that it will be easy for the people, which are intelligent and all that, to become the president of this country. Without being a millionaire, it is for your intelligence and your ability. That's what we are fighting for. Whether I'll be with or not, what will be the benefit of our individual? What I'm expressing as my full advantage. What I was saying is for you people. If you turn a dead guy to me, you'll be the sufferer, not me. I'll be enjoying myself in the grave. But those other people, Open your eyes. You are allowed to be carried away by money, by anything, or by any propaganda. They have plenty of naira and dollars to spend. Oh, be candidates, we have no money to spend, but we spend our ideas that this country must be better for you, for people like you, the young girls and young women. Yeah. Well said, sir. And a government that can afford our university to be closed for nine months. That is what will be stands for, to change the thing. The floor is carrying those away, the man is galvanizing all over the country, all over the world. Coming back home to say what is happening, are you all dead? Or are you still alive? Or are you going away? That is, is, that, is, that, is that the president? And you are still talking about what is happening. Go, think of it. Let Nigeria take up that thing in cars. Forget the city. Oh, be your right man. He's the man for your, your, for your age. That can carry the young men of this country. I have seen enough to test that. 
I have seen enough, and I know enough of all other these candidates. But when we get to the Arena campaign, we, we, we say all that. Pa, pa Debanjod, for